How's it going guys? English Twist, I take assist. Thanks for joining me today and for showing me your support. The subject of today's video is an application review. Uh, I found myself with a bit of time on my hands so I thought I'd go ahead have a perusal around the iTunes library. Okay, and during my searches this is the application that I actually found. It's called the RPA Tech Air Mouse. Okay, priced at $5.99 and essentially what this application is it's a, a wireless mouse uh, utilizing obviously the functionality of your phone's accelerometer and other um, other abilities that your iPhone offers you okay and it puts all those functions into this one application to bring you this very functionally able uh, wireless mouse in inverted commas um, because what this also uh, offers you is the ability to utilize the iPhone's keypad okay so not only will you be able to control your phone's cursor with your phone and um, it actually enables you to like I say write text you know visit websites without having to use your keyboard you can place it down um, essentially at a distance from you and uh, you won't have to worry about actually having to use the computer itself you can just do all the functionality straight from your from your phone uh, so I think from that angle that that's absolutely brilliant you know it's up to you whether you whether you decide to agree with me or not but you know essentially that's why I'm doing this review because I personally think this is quite a cool little design okay and right here on the applications uh, App Store, you have two views of the application. This one right here is your touchpad. This is basically where you'll run your finger around the mouse, you know, for movement of the cursor. And remember, this application also incorporates the phone's accelerometer, so you can uh, twist your wrist left to right, move the cursor left to right, up and down, and the cursor will move up and down. So it's very cool, you know. Um, it's got a great little design. Uh, design aspect there um, and the other view is the buttons the left and right buttons here uh, you have the middle click and you have the, the scroll the scroll button okay so it's very cool um, you know, you've got all your function pads control alt, the windows button up here this is actually the button that you use on the application to switch the views back and forth like this and in the top left here is the, the settings this is where you would do the tweaks of you know the mouse sensitivity just basically the, the finer tweaks of the mouse's actual functionality uh, and we'll get into that uh, so basically once you've read the application uh, description you come down here and you'll see why I actually chose to actually uh, purchase this application is because of the positive feedback that it got. It's uh, got 405 reviews, and essentially, you know, that they're, they're all uh, in positive view. Uh, if you have time to check out the 405 reviews, uh, you'll see that they're all in fairly good faith at this product. So, you know, that was a, that was a very good incentive uh, for me to want to see what this product was all about. You know, and I, I hope you guys actually get what you want from this video. You know, you'll get to see whether you would actually want to branch out and and purchase this product for five ninety nine, or if you're happy with just using your mouse's keypad, or um, you know, perhaps you already have a wireless mouse. You know, because I th like I say, for five ninety nine, uh, regardless of how much the phone actually cost, you know, you're getting a wireless mouse for five ninety nine, which in anybody's book is brilliant. Plus, you know, like it has the the uh, keyboard incorporated into it, which actually, uh, unless I'm much mistaken, uh, wireless mice don't actually have keyboards. <laughs> Alright, I was playing silly with you there, guys. Alright, so basically, once you've read all the description, you'll find that in order to run this software on your computer, you're going to have to install um, a, an app, uh, a piece of software from mobileairmouse.com. So, what we'll do is we'll go ahead and we'll jump over to that site right now. Here it is, Mobile Air Mouse, and this website basically offers you all the full, full description, in-depth view of how to actually use it. And for you Mac guys out there, or if you're on Windows and you're thinking about this product, it works for both. It complements both uh, operating systems. So if you're on Mac or Windows, fear not, because you can use it on uh, either or. Okay, and uh, what else does this website have? It has the uh, it has a help section, so you know it will it gives you a full debrief uh, in more in-depth fashion, other than what the App Store actually provided you with. And here we have you know basic descriptions on functionality of it that uh, accentuates the whole accelerometer movements, you know scrolling, uh, installation of the software, um, 
that's what it looks like when you've actually installed the software onto your computer um, and this is basically the settings that you'll find when you actually uh, when you press that button in the top left remember I showed you guys on the on the images uh, right here yeah how you control the sensitivity etc okay and this is how you connect it to your computer but well, I'll show you that and actually on uh, piggybacking on this point it does say when you install this software uh, on your computer you do actually have to make sure that the uh, that your firewall is um, disabled for a short for a short period of time because they say in this troubleshoot section that if you're having problems installing it and getting your phone to connect to the computer it, it, it could be a cause of your firewall so you know just remember that guys when you're installing this uh, software make sure that you do actually have your firewall uh, disabled for a couple of minutes but what you're going to do is you're going to select your operating system and then you're going to run the steps uh, it'll whip through fairly quickly. I'm not actually going to run the setup, guys. Uh, it's basic install, uh, uh, basic install process. I already have it installed on my system, so I'm not actually going to uh, install it again. But once you have actually installed it and it's all set up, then you will be addressed with this application here. Okay, here it is, guys. This is basically what we saw on the website. This is basic configuration. You'll uh, it'll pop up. It'll identify the server for you. Uh, it'll get your IP address which you can see here. I've got mine blocked off right now. And this is where you can do some tweaks of the actual uh, of the configuration of the mouse, you know, the motion, the the air motion, you know, this is the the touch sensitivity and the air motion. This is from how you're using accelerometer, you know, from twisting your wrist up and down. You know, you can uh, adjust the sensitivity of that one. Okay, and once you've actually verified that that's all correct, uh, you can press apply to save it. Um, so it will always stay there. And when you're fully done, you just press done. And then we come over to our iPhone. Okay, guys, and as you can see, I'm using my uh, Type VNC viewer to be able to uh, see the iPhone on my computer. If you want to know how to do this, go ahead and check out my tutorial, and I'll give you a full walkthrough on how to actually get this up. All right. Well, now we'll come into our uh, Air Mouse application. Once we've set up all our computer software, we open it up, give it a second or two. Do 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 do. All right. Here we go. And and look at that. There we go. Now I'm able to control my. Uh, cursor with my phone. As you can see on the screen here, see this yellow? That's where I'm actually pressing my mouse right now. See that as I scroll across? I'll do it slowly so you can see it moving. Okay, there's a bit of a lag there guys, but it is going as you can see. And this, this, as you can hear there are sounds to this. We can do the... Um, see where I'm going to have a problem here guys is that if it right clicks on that screen I'm going to bounce out the application. So, alright. As you can hear, guys, let's right click, searching around, searching. Alright, let's bounce back to this. Let's go ahead and grab the page, and there we go. See, works perfectly. Excellent. Well, there you go, guys. I'm not going to dwell on this anymore. As you can see, it works perfectly. Fairly easy to set up. Uh, it's actually baby steps, you know, you just download, set up and you're good to go once you've opened up the application. It should be great. Um, you know what I haven't actually done? I didn't show you the, the other view. What I'll do is, you know, when you press this, uh, when you press the settings button, it actually flips you over to the server. You've got to make sure that this is checked to make sure that you are connected to the right server. And this is where you can enable and disable the sounds um, and also the frequency. Yeah, there you go, guys. All right, well... This has been an application review of the RPA Tech Air Mouse, the App Store. All right, guys, you can't see me, but you know what time it is. It's time to rock out. This is English Twist signing out.